kind of paint from, I draw all the time and just kind of pick something that looks cool from my sketchbook and go with it. And just kind of, uh, you know, like I tend to find meaning or, or uh, make sense of it after the fact. You know, so I don't I don't go into it thinking like I have to make a mural that represents this or that or or whatever. I just kind of paint it and uh, figure it out after. Um, there's a lot of uh, a lot of odd influence from um, just whatever was going on at the time. You know, the debauchery of the of the moment. Uh, and I and I've I've also heard that it's the it's the most hated of the three murals. Right, really? but, yeah, I've heard it for a few times, so you know, um, I don't, I don't know, I don't know how to, how to feel, how to feel about that. I've heard from a few people. They're like, they're like, yeah, some people don't like it, but I love it. And this it's is like, Stan's uh, okay. favorite one. Yeah, Stan oh. said this is his favorite one. It oh. works with the architecture. I tend to, I tend to, uh, to, to, to dabble into, you know, similar, similar influences as, as far as like, you know, different, different religious influences. Um, I, I just I tend to borrow and just kind of pull, and that's how that's how my sketches tend to develop. And uh, like like I said, like those go those are like pretty much the skeletons for for paintings like these, you know. And yeah, of course, like uh, the, the doing like the Ganesh and like doing like you know doing that. Like I I, I mean I, I look at some of that art and I just I you know some of the uh, like like some of the Indian art and things like that. And I any anything that's really yeah, Canadian art. I love Canadian art. Yeah, Mike Howe. He's my favorite Canadian artist, Mike, Michael Howe. Uh, yeah, but, you know, I mean, the, the influences just kind of vary and just kind of come from everywhere. And, and uh, in the end, it just kind of becomes uh, a sort of collage of, of, uh, of colors and shapes and, and different types of influences. And, and not even just influences, but things that I just really love, you know, and I kind of tend to pull them in. Um, of course, there's like the triangle pattern. You know that that uh, is is, a, is an ongoing theme throughout my work and and uh, some of the other my, my other uh, buddies' work. So, um, I mean, it's if you if you look into a lot of like very indigenous art, they tend to use the the triangle pattern. It's just kind of just it, I mean, it, it, it's like in uh, a lot of like uh, like Polynesian cultures they use it. Um, if you look in like. It, it, yeah, it's it's everywhere. It, it's just it, it's like an ongoing thing. Like if you look, if you even look into like a lot of uh, like African mass, they they use it a lot, you know. So it's just, and I mean the triangle just makes sense. It's it's the trinity, you know. It's it's the ongoing. It's just a, it's just an awesome shape to draw, and it just it it, uh, it 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 evokes all these different feelings in different people, and you know, I, I mean, I I it's an, it's a fun. It's just a fun thing to draw. I love drawing it, you know. It's, I love drawing it. I love